What do we want to say? First, second, third. And then the D is draft. I'm going to give that one to you. You need to write about, think about what you are going to say, choose and organize, and then start writing. We have a picture. And we already said it's people in a raft and on white water, rafting. How would you feel if you were right about a challenging adventure? The adventure can be real or imagined. Okay. Let's go back to the prompt. Write a story about a challenging adventure. Are there any words in this prompt that we don't know what they mean? Does everybody know what challenging means? What does it mean? Like. Okay. Well, if we don't know what it means, what do we need to do? Look it up. So, so look up challenge. Okay, so we're going to write a story about a challenging adventure. What's adventure mean? What does it mean? Something cool. What is a challenging adventure? We know challenging means it's going to be difficult and or exciting. It takes a lot of work. It's new. It's interesting. So we got that part. And this is just... Does everybody get the idea? So it's something different. Probably something out of the ordinary. What is the prompt asking us to do? Write a what? Story. So when we hear the word story, what do we think about? What do we have to have in a literary? What are the elements of a story? Setting. What? What? Okay, now, when we get to plot, we have to have something that looks like this, right? You have to have this. You have to have that. Because another thing you have to have to have all these things is conflict. You have to have a conflict. Somebody's got to have a problem with somebody else. Or you've got to have a problem with yourself. Can you argue with yourself? Can you be mad at yourself? Yeah. Oh, why did I do that? I'm such a room. Mm. I broke up with him. Why did I talk to him today? Ah, oh, I can stand him. Right? Yes. So you could have one character, but the conflict would be where? In their head. Okay? It would be in their head. Okay? You have to have a resolution. Have to, have to, have to. And because we have to have those, we have to have rising action. We have to have falling action. Just write about what your character is doing right now. What is your character doing? Remember, you're making this up. And it's got to be, they're going to be doing what? The prompt tells you what they're going to be doing, right? Yeah. What do they have to be doing? The adventure. A, cha a challenging adventure. So, write about, so you've got to pick your adventure, right? What's your character doing right now? Does that make sense? Yes. Okay. Right. What is the <laughs> You have to make up a character. Or you can use yourself and just give yourself a different name. Like my name's Tony, I can call myself Louise. Okay? Is that a made up character now? Yes, or I can call myself Tony. It really doesn't matter. Then I've got to also think about what's the prompt asking me to write a story about. It's asking me to write a story where I've got characters or a character doing something exciting, doing something interesting. Does that make sense? So I've got to write a story about a character, a person that I'm making up doing something interesting. And it can be completely and totally made up. Or it can be something that actually happened, that you did, or somebody did, or you saw on TV. The wall and thought, what in the world is that? Should be a question mark. He knew his mom had wanted to remodel the kitchen, and he had dreaded this day. He liked having the power of going to the door and whining, and everyone in the house jumping to their feet. Who is the character? Mom. 
Hank. Hank. There's my character. What's the setting? Kitchen. The kitchen. Did I say we are in the kitchen? No. I didn't say Hank. I just, you just get it by reading it. In the kitchen. So we're in a house, we're in a kitchen. What's going on with Hank? Do we know the conflict yet? No. Well, we know it has something to do with what? With the hole. With, with the hole. Because he's already told us that he has dreaded this day. <gasps> so I bet the conflict's going to have something to do with this hole that's now been cut in the wall. How about um, Billy? I want you to write about there's the problem that they have. So you may have to bring in another character or something. Something's got to happen now when you write that's a problem. That they go, oh. Okay. They're going to have conflict. When you write this time, I need. And is it big or little? Yeah. It's little. And what does Hank not like? Small. Small spaces. And what is his mom doing? Trying to get She's him. on the other side like this going, Hank, hey, come here. What's she trying to get him to do? To get inside. To go through that door. Right. Because he likes going through the big door. That's so mean. Yeah, because when he goes to the door, he goes, Everybody runs over, you know, to let him out. So what's the conflict? He's going down. Well, why were they on a rope anyway? What are they doing? He was going to go to get something. Okay. Is he on a mountain or? In a volcano. He's in a volcano. So he's in a volcano, on a rope, and in a volcano, what is there down below? Lava. Lava. Oh, my God. It's hot. Okay. And if the rope breaks, what's going to happen? What will happen to him? He'll die. He'll die. Okay. Think about your character's tire. Think about your character surfing and they're afraid of waves. Think about you've got a cut finger. Try to solve the problem. Have your character try to solve the problem. He swung? Yeah, he And, and what happened? If you want to give went a teacher to a name, you can get to the side. Yeah. You get on the ground. Good. Good. You it's guys have. It's nobody. I know this is kind of hard, but you, all of you have character or characters. You have setting. They're in all kinds of thrilling, great places. You've got surfing and climbing a mountain and a volcano and some kind of party. Okay? And that there was a problem, and now the, you kind of know the steps, right? You know, and they tell you what to write about. And this, they don't give you the characters. Okay, you have to come up with a lot out of your own head. It's it's a little bit hard. Does it mean you can't do it? No, oh, because you all just did it. Okay, all of you just did it. And if we had more time, we would keep going, and we would edit like we did yesterday.